And now to a health warning you need to hear. Folks at Sacramento Yolo Mosquito and Vector Control are warning about invasive mosquitoes tonight, saying in just the last few hours they were detected in the Citrus Heights area and also portions of Placer County. Invasive mosquitoes are a significant public health threat because they can transmit dangerous viruses such as Zika, Dengue, and Chikungunya. If that's not concerning enough, experts say these mosquitoes are aggressive. What makes these mosquitoes different than the mosquitoes that we have here that are native to our area um, is that these bite aggressively at all times of the day. These are container breeding mosquitoes, very small mosquitoes. We're told something as small as a cap full of water is enough to breed these mosquitoes. And so make sure you don't have any standing water around your home. And look at this. Vector Control took to Facebook announcing they are offering free mosquito fish to help control the overall mosquito population. And listen to this. Right now, uh, the scope of our work is trying to figure out the extent of the of the infestation, if you will. And that's what we have crews going out, conducting door to door inspections and treatments. And then we're also doing some treatments to try and uh, our goal is to make sure that we're that this is kept, um, you know, that this this does not expand. This comes as health officials issued a new warning about a rare mosquito borne illness that has turned deadly. The virus Eastern Equine Encephalitis or Triple E is now threatened at least six states. Patients can go from being perfectly normal to paralyzed or even dead within 12 to 48 hours. The first death this season was in Massachusetts. 50 year old Lori Sylvia passed away Sunday with four cases detected there. Officials are now spraying for mosquitoes where 30 communities are at high risk. In Michigan, there are three more cases, including 14 year old Savannah Dayhart, who is now on a ventilator and feeding tube. Now we don't share this information to scare you, but to remind you that mosquito borne illnesses can be life threatening. Thankfully, there are no reports of Triple E in California. The focus here is on those invasive or yellow fever mosquitoes. Again, Vector Control is going door to door doing inspections to try and keep track of this issue.